Uh, hey friends, welcome to the channel. Uh, this is a carpenter. You're watching uh, uh, the Carpenter TV on uh, YouTube. Anyways, I'm gonna do a quick tool uh, review uh, that I didn't really have planned. It's kind of spur of the moment thing, uh, and that is um, let me see if I can find the wrapper. Um, here we are. Here we are. Um, CLC <clears throat> heavy duty work suspenders. Now I've uh, quick quick backstory. I've I've commonly found myself going back and forth from um, these these uh, padded suspenders right here that my bags are on. Right now everything's about to fall out because I'm changing the bags and you know how that is. So <clears throat> I tried. I went and moved. Now I still haven't tried the Occidental. Now. That's my only, that's my, that's my plan, that's my first plan was, <clears throat> when I get the money, I'm going to get the Occidentals to go with the belt. But until then, I had to find a good suspender, not only that matched the Occidental in design, but really did what they could support, because nothing works better than the Occidental suspenders. So long story short, I went through these, these Huskies, I don't know if you can see that, these Huskies right here. All right, I went through two pairs of those, okay? Um, the garbage, they're no, they're no good. I went through the um, the AWs. Uh, let me see, right here. Uh, yeah, the AWPs, I went through a set of those, one set, garbage. And then I went through the uh, AWP elastic basic suspenders, which I always find myself going back to. Right, the most basic suspender to me ends up being the most comfortable for the Occidental uh, flex or adjust the fit uh, framer belt system. You know, framer slash uh, finish, framer, framer slash finish carpenter um, bag setup. But it's, I mean, they're right here. They're right here. <clears throat> These are my babies. All right, I have I have quite a bit of sets of bags, but um, by far these are my best set. These are the ones I use on the job. These are the ones I use primarily. I, this, I've had them for a year now, and it's literally taken me a year to break them in, and it, they're still not really fully broken. But I'm just now getting them down. Hands down, the best people out there. I'm, you know, I'm sorry to say to the Buckaroo guys or the, uh, or the. Um, uh, who else? Uh, the diamond. Oh, those are the big. Those are other big. The diamond guy who's <laughs> who just hate Occidental, but their bags look like they're carrying their whole uh, high school locker <laughs> on on each side of their. Oh my God! Can you, have you seen some? Look, Matt Bangs would. I'm sorry, bro. You have a great channel. You're you're an unbelievable framer. You know, but man, your bags, bro. <laughs> your bags have to be insanely uncomfortable. I mean, I'm sorry, bro. But shout out to you, everyone. You hit him up. Hit his channel up. He is amazing, amazing framer. I I. Literally watch his videos at night and take notes. He's he's somewhere. so uh, it was a friendly crossfire across the bow there, buddy. So uh, <laughs> I'm a small channel, so it's not like you're gonna see it. Anyways, um, Occidental, the only way to go. So now my last resort, the C CLCs, the, the 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 trusty the durable CLC brand has been around. Now I'm trying their their elastic basic. Um suspender you know remember i said before i've always turned back to, out of those huskies crap those awps crap i mean everything milwaukee's crap i mean everything but i'm a picky person look at I me mean, i mean i wear occidental so i'm extremely i'm extremely picky i mean look after this set i had this is my newest set look at my, my the set i had before this i had the occidental all leather pure framer and I still wear these from time to time because they are the best bags. With I got my fastener pouch in the back. <clears throat> um, the, yeah, by far the best bags in on the world. But these are the classic Framer all leather fucking man's bags. They get heavy in the rain. Fuck yeah, man! You drag them bitches along, but no, I'm just joking. They are the best. I love them. I keep them in good shape and oil them down. They'll, they'll last forever. As you can see, I've had these for a long time. But if something happens to your bags, Occidental is so good with their customers that they, I mean, if my bag were to rip right now, I'd send it in. They'd either fix it or they'd send me a new bag free of charge. 
hands down the best warranty. I mean, I mean these are lifelong. I'll have these bags. I'll pass these bags on to my kids, you know, if I ever have any. <laughs> so I went from those bags. After I fell in love with those, then the adjust -to fit came out. And I was skeptical about them. I was just, for the first six months, I was like, oh, my God, I picked the wrong setup. But why didn't I go with the fat lip? Blah, 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 blah. You know, I wanted the, the fabric, the fiber, and the leather. I wanted to get away from the all leather. But, but well, in the summertime, I'm wearing, I wear the all leather quite a bit. But I'm just really trying to break in my adjust -to fit down there. And for a while, I thought I made the wrong move. But then after reading reviews and then me getting used uh, me tweaking it you know moving around seeing what i'm taking part that's this is the bags that taught me how to i don't need everything in my bags i need my my square my tape measure you know my my fucking stud finder um my chalk line uh and that's it a chisel i mean that's it you can see my bag set up my laser level because i'm a trim carpenter but when i'm framing it's, there's nothing in there but a chalk line and a fucking pencil and a framing square so but you're gonna see all these suspenders set up real quick because I gotta get back to work. So I'm gonna put those on. I'm, I'm trying the new I'm trying the new suspenders. See if they work. Without even adjusting them right out the bank. I mean First impression, first impression is these buckles compared to the AWPs, hands down, way stronger, way more durable. This, these feel like they're they're durable, like they're, ooh, they're they they they're last forever. They go with the durableness of my bags, you know. It's not like shitty, uh, shitty, and then and then all right, and then nice, and then and then good quality bags. You know, you just don't get that. So here, we're gonna try these on. Let's see. Oh, already, fellas, this is looking good. Already, fellas, this is looking great. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. I think I found them. Until I can afford my Occidentals, I think I found them, ladies and gentlemen. Loosen that up a little bit. I love the way they're so uh, stiff and... They're like, you can tell they're made with great quality. Now let's, let's tighten up the belts. I'm gonna have to loosen up my, uh, loosen up my uh, just a fit here. Those are, ooh, these are just, that was the back look, fellas. How's the back, how, how's the back look, friends? You good? Quite right, sure. I mean, look at these. Hands down. I found them. So. So, conclusion to this uh, tool. For one, this isn't the end of it because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wear them for a week and I'll do another tool review on them and let you know then. But right now, I'm telling you right now, these, these just went on these bags. I don't think they're coming off until I get the Occidentals. Which I can't afford them right now. It'll be a while when I tell I do afford them, but when I do, they're they're gonna be the ones going on. But these ones will go on my my other Occidental bags because these are just as good. These can hang with Occidental. Their quality can hang with Occidental. Well done, CLC. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna run them for a week, and do another tool review. So y'all, if you're all interested in seeing this, please t t smash the like button. Smash the subscribe button and you'll get a notification for when that this next video drops. So go ahead and do that for me and support the channel. And uh, we'll see you guys then.